Got one, man. Woo, that's a bad big old man. Look at them damn nice teeth on there, man. It's like a dang old Taco Grande, man, with them dang old new loops, man. Woo! Yeah, Hank, man, will be bogarting that dang old bait. What is going on and welcome back guys. Uh, we're gonna be doing some kayak fishing. I'm all ready to go, set up. Dave's getting his stuff set up. And uh, we'll be on the water shortly, so stay tuned. What I'm gonna be using is a red hammer swim bait, bunch of glitter, um, red jig head. I believe it's three ounces. My neighbor gave it to me, so I'm not you know, 100% sure. And then, I got a Berkeley Gulp uh, nuclear chicken. Let's go. Okay, now I got something. Oh no, God, it came off. I had something. Go over there a little bit. I think we're hooked up. I think. Yep. Oh, I got a lead cod. Woo! It looks uh, looks a little short. Hey, you don't have any, uh, I don't know where my grip is. Huh? Yeah. I don't my grip, my, my. 21. Uh-oh. 21 inch link cod. It's a uh, blue. You know, you know why they're blue? It's because of their diet. Yeah, it's what they uh, their diet. Oh, look at those teeth. Oh, he's trying to bite. All right, let's get it released. Yeah. Yeah. And it's funny he didn't he didn't bite on this the hammer the red hammer. The jig head, he didn't bite on that, but he bit on the nuclear chicken. Berkeley Gulp nuclear chicken. Yeah. One inch shy, one inch shy. But hey, but at least I can say I caught a link cod. Dang, I can't believe I was one inch short of a keeper link cod. 
But uh, yeah, if you didn't know, um, the reason why they, you know, have that blue color to them or teal or aqua, whatever, it's uh, based on their diet. The same thing with Cabazon. We're on again! I just dropped it! Oh! You know, what if it's the same link cod? Uh, no, what the heck is this? Huh? Let's get him in the boat first. Wow, that's a nice fish. What, you, you think it's a kelp greenling? Huh? It's uh, it's like brown. We can keep these, right? Should I keep it or toss it? Oh, Jesus, everybody's biting the nuclear chicken. Uh oh. Oh, the about the. Okay, that's what happened. All right, let's try this again. There we go. I got me a gopher fish! Woo! Come on. Finally something bit other other than the Berkeley Gulp sandworm. I mean Berkeley Gulp sandworm. Bo Berkeley Gulp uh, nuclear, nuclear chicken. Yeah, another species, gopher fish. Um, the other fish were biting on the nuclear chicken, uh, Berkeley gulp grub, and, uh, this gopher fish hit on the, the red hammer, uh, with the red jig head. I believe it's three ounces. Um, you know, my neighbor, my neighbor gave me the jig head because she was cleaning out her garage, and, uh, I was actually going to get one of these, but it's kind of cool that she, you know, gave it to me, so, uh. Thank you, if you end up watching this. We're hooked up again! Woo! Oh, snap! It's fighting hard! Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go! Oh, I doubled up! I got two reds!
Yeah, two reds. Woo! Hooked up again. Let's go. Is it blue or black? I think it's a black. Black or blue, one of the two. We'll uh, identify these when we get back to the shore. Oh, come on, bit on the red hammer, woo! Hooked up again! Oh no! Three fish came up, oh my god! I believe two of them were blue rockfish. I don't know what the other ones were. Let's see if I can get them again. Let's see if we can get them again, let's go, let's go! They're biting though, they're biting. How deep is it right here? 45? Oh no, I got stuck again. Yep, stuck. I think I broke the tip of my pole off. Or not the tip, I didn't break it, but it looks like garbage. <laughs> looks like I took a hammer to it. When I was trying to get off that, uh, or when I was snagged. All right, guys, we're gonna head in, check out what we got. And uh, yeah, the swells are getting pretty big, so we're getting pushed south, like really fast. Today was a good day. Dave caught a gopher fish, but he threw it back. And uh, let's head back in. 
All right, guys, we got, I want to say it's a black rockfish, big red, two reds, go for fish in the middle. And anybody want to tell me if this is a kelp green, I want to say it's kelp greenling, Dave says it's a, Dave says it's kelp bass, but uh, I'll identify it hopefully a little later. And I hope you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, smash that subscribe button, and uh, until next time, fish on. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, smash that subscribe button, and uh, yeah, that uh, that link caught just one inch too short. God, but I popped my cherry on a link cod, so now I can say that I'm part of the I caught a link cod club. And uh, until next time, fish on.